Hi everyone and welcome to another Open Studio video. I hope you are all doing okay in these difficult times. Uh, for our check-in today, think about something from your cultural heritage which gives you some comfort and some strength. Um, I have a German background and I love the fairy tales that my parents read to me as a child and I think of those and I have a book of them I sometimes read them to make me feel better at this time so I don't know what it is for you but it would be think of something and it can give us strength I wanted to show you, here's an old German book of fairy tales. There's some old illustrations. And then I have another one that's also, it's got colourful illustrations. Those are Anderson's fairy tales. This version is also in German. So those, those are my comfort cultural objects. Okay, so keep that thing in your mind. And when you're not feeling so good, Think of that thing and maybe it can bring you some comfort. What we're going to be doing for today is looking at some of the treasures that African art has to offer us. Because we live in South Africa, we all can draw on African treasures as part of our cultural resources. And I'm going to be choosing three pieces of African art to show to you today and you can choose to draw your favorite one. So let's have a look at what those are. So this is our first object for today, which is a carved ivory head that comes from the Benin people of West Africa, today in Nigeria. So, so the Benin people are famous for their ivory carvings and bronze castings of their queen and king heads and also their wooden carvings and many of their art pieces are represented in museums all over the world so it's the Benin people if you remember that Benin people from Nigeria they are master arts people from hundreds of years ago and I'm inviting all of you to sketch this beautiful ivory head if that appeals to you. So maybe you could just pause it on this image and just take a pencil and some paper and try and sketch this treasure from West Africa. Okay, and then our second treasure is from the Vendor people in South Africa. And these are some of the pots. And they are over a hundred years old. You can see how beautiful, beautiful decorations. So maybe you prefer to sketch these vendor pots, that's our second art treasure for today. So again, you would take your pencil and paper and you're just going to try and get the form of the pots and then add in the decorations. Again, you can pause it on the image and sketch it.
And our final art treasure for today, I hope you can see this okay, is this magnificent carved door that comes from Zanzibar in East Africa. So Zanzibar is an island just off Tanzania and imagine having a door like this for your front entrance. I'm just going to move it closer so that you can see some of the carvings better. So maybe you could create your own kind of Zanzibar door with all kinds of decorations. Okay, so we've seen three art treasures from West Africa, from South Africa and from East Africa. And my invitation to everyone today is to just try and sketch one of those that appeals to you and then send it through to Lefika so that we can see what you've created. And remember to draw on the strength of your cultural object or cultural practice or story that gives you strength and I wish you all the best until next time bye thank you for joining our online open studio we hope to see you again soon please remember to send us your artwork and creations you can post it to any of our social media sites and tag us or send us an email Open Studio is supported by the Mary Oppenheimer and Daughters Foundation and Rand Merchant Bank.